Hey guys, Math Tutorials 14 here, and we're back in another tutorial. And so today, as you can see, I'm going to show you guys how to jailbreak iOS, and I will show you. Um, I forget the exact version, so I'm going to general about how to jailbreak iOS version 4.3.3, and I believe it supports um, iOS version 5 and above. Um, I think it stops at like almost iOS 6. It does not work, does not support for iOS 6. Otherwise, um, we wouldn't have had to go through Red Snow and do that whole thing for 6.1.3. Um, so this this uh, this tool will, will only work for um, iOS 4.3.3 and I believe iOS 5. So let's go ahead. Um, it's as easy as basically swiping. As you can see, um, it's basically just as easy as sliding the screen to unlock and then you get the jailbreak. So. You're going to, and I will put this link in the description box below. Um, those of you who want to do it right now, as um as you're watching this, you probably want to watch this video on your um iPod or iPad or iPhone, whatever you're jailbreaking, um using this version. Um, and you're, you can go into the link in the description below, or you can just um copy what I'm doing, and you don't have to do it. But um, basically, all we're typing in is jail break me.com and then we're gonna hit go then it's going to start loading up as you can see right there jailbreakme.com um, sometimes it takes a second so I'm just gonna go like this jailbreakme.com 3.0 okay it may take a second or two because my Wi-Fi like I've said in past videos is sometimes not that great so um it's actually sometimes it's better if I just do this. So we're gonna gonna disconnect from Wi-Fi here. Wi-Fi off. Wi-Fi on. Sorry, sorry, I'm doing this, guys. It's just kind of have to. Oh, didn't mean to hit other. Kind of have to do that. Okay. So now that I'm connected back to my Wi-Fi, it will load back up, and it will say. As you can see right there, it'll say this site is very old by now and does not support recent firmware like iOS 6, um, but you can still use it to uh, jailbreak um, iOS version 4 and um, a little bit above, I think. Um, so here's more information about the jailbreak. Is jailbreak me reversible? Yes, it is. All you have to do is um, restore in iTunes. Can jailbreaking break my device? Um, it says jailbreak me per, per do, um, provides a, sale, a safe jailbreak that will not break it. So we're just going to go ahead, we're going to hit back, we're going to hit free right here. It's just really um, like getting an app from the app store. We're going to hit free, and then after that we're just going to, it'll say install, we'll just do that. And then it should load up here. Come on. There we go. And now it's installing Cydia right there, as you can see. Um, I thought it was slide to jailbreak. Maybe that's the uh, the newer ones. But um, anyway, there's Cydia. Bam! Our device is now jailbroken. It was really that easy. That's all you have to do. I'm going to say user. Done. And this is an untethered version of jailbreak. So as you can see, it says iPad. Um, one. It's the first generation. iOS 4.3.3 and Cydia 1.1.2. Um, it comes with all of the, um, all of this stuff here. Um, let's see, we got, uh, we got Barrel, we got Zephyr, we got all this stuff. Um, I can even show you guys Harlem Shake right now. Let's go ahead and do that. Shake. That should work. I don't know why nothing's coming up. Winter. Nothing's coming up. Why is nothing coming up? Alright. Let me just see if I can fix that here, guys. Sorry about that. Um, it may only be designed for... Let's just try it again. Can we look up barrel? Let's see. We're going to just reload that. Because I think... We didn't get it enough time to download some packages. So, like if we go into sources. 
Yeah, like the big boss isn't there. Going to just get out of that. And we'll reopen Cydia here. Um, so it was really that easy to jailbreak. Um, yeah. So at the top here, you can see. Um, as you can see, I did the wrong thing by hitting uh, cancel. You do not want to do that. Just wait till it um, loads up all the packages because after it's done that, you will see in all the repos that you do have stuff. Um, without that, you can't download anything, and Cydia just becomes useless after that. So let's go into here and see if we can look for the Harlem Shake. So I'll be right back in a second. Uh, I'm not going anywhere. I'm just putting this down here so I can type in Harlem Shake. Harlem Shake. As you can see, there it is. I don't know why it said reloading data. I didn't hit anything. But um, should work. And then if this will work, I can make it do the Harlem Shake. All right. I'm going to hit install here. It's going to tell us to respring. Oh, okay. So the requested modifications cannot be applied due to... Okay. So unfortunately, guys, as it looks, you cannot use the Harlem Shake on um, iOS 4.0 and above. It has to be iOS 6. So that's unfortunate. But um, yeah, guys, that's how to do it. You can get Winterboard um, and things like that. Um, yeah, guys, so that's it for this video. Um, make sure you tune in for my um, my video on it's an upcoming video that will be happening in the next couple, couple weeks to a couple months. Um, and next, and the next video on how to, um, or not how to, um, the next video on my top 30 Cydia tweaks. Um, so, yeah, guys, um, that is how you get Cydia on your iPad or iPod or iPhone version. Um, that would be version, I don't know why I just did that. That would be version 4 point, wait, I just got to check real fast. That would be version 4.3.3. So that is it for this video, guys. Make sure you rate, like, comment, and subscribe for more content. And that's it for this video, guys. So I guess for now, I will talk to you guys later.